my friends welcome back to my channel I hope you're having a wonderful day today I am so excited for today's video because as you can tell by the title it is a gift guide video I do this for you guys every year and I like to provide a list of Lux gifts that I myself would like to receive so this is going to be a special gift that you want to get for that special someone in your life or if you want to treat yourself as well I have a list I want to say I have about maybe 13 items that I came up with and all of these items are around the $500 range I think I have one or two items that are a little more than that and I can definitely do gift guides in the future if you want that are a little less than that but because we talk about luxury handbags and all sorts of fun stuff on my channel I wanted to focus on luxury gifts and I think I came up with, with some good ones and to top it all off we also have an unboxing a little unboxing of something that I think would be a good gift I actually purchased this for myself it's something I have been eyeing for a while and I thought this video would be a good time to feature because I think it would be a great luxury gift to give someone so without further ado let's go ahead let's get started oh if you're curious about my top I got this top a couple years ago but I think they have the same one so I'll link it down below in case you're interested and then my lip you know I have to wear a red lip usually I wear the YSL but today this is Gerard Cosmetics um, I like it because it's more of a metallic red so I'll link that down below as well so let's go ahead get in get into it the first gift that I want to mention and I actually did a dedicated video on this but it is the Christian Dior Vinadier little clutch set so it comes in this beautiful box and you get this gold clutch now the nice thing about this one it is rather larger than the ones from previous years I will put some pictures of what the prior clutches look like so this one is nice because not only is it a sizable clutch and not only does it come with a lipstick and then three refills but you can remove this and you can insert your phone if you want the details on this all the swatches uh, everything there is to know about it I did a dedicated video on this I did some match shots as well but you get the clutch it also comes with a chain and Dior does some of the best holiday packaging not only that but they do some of the best holiday gifts with purchase as well Black Friday recently passed and I actually did place an online order that video will probably be up after this one but I got a whole bunch of stuff from Dior Beauty and I got the best free gift with purchase not only good free gifts with purchase but also they have a great loyalty program you can get free gifts as well so I think this would be an amazing gift for someone like I said not only do you get the four lipsticks but you can also use this as a clutch I used the one I had last year when I went out on Christmas Eve it's just such a nice one but I like how this one will fit your phone as well and I do have the iPhone 14 and it fits great in here so this is the first gift, not only because it's an amazing gift, but also the packaging is beautiful as well. Okay, now for some of these gifts, I'm gonna give options. Like I'm gonna give a more affordable option and then a more luxe option. So the next gift that I wanna mention is the beautiful Chanel mirror. Now, you might know that recently they came out with the Codes Color Collection. I stocked up on these mirrors. These are no longer available. However, the black one is, and this is just a nice gift to get for someone to have a Chanel mirror in their purse it is a double-sided mirror so one is a regular mirror the other is a magnifying mirror so this is the first option if you really really wanted to be fancy and get them a luxe gift then I would recommend the Dior mirror from the premier collection it comes in this beautiful box it opens like this this is where the mirror is and here it is I have actually been using it it comes with this little Dior pouch and look how stunningly beautiful this mirror is now this was an expensive mirror but if you saw my video on this I did mention to you guys that I knew I wanted to get something from the premier collection and it was this a lip brush or a lipstick and I thought this was something that was going to stand the test of time and I have been using this in my purse again I was a little disappointed it wasn't um a compact mirror it is just this is on one side and then the mirrors on the other but it does come with a little case 
and then to store it it does have this little box and once again if you purchase this it comes with a lot of free gifts with purchase which you can't beat so I would say this for a more luxe option and then if you wanted something a little more affordable go for the Chanel mirror so the next gift number three I have two options for you as well I have a more affordable option and I have the more luxe option and it is a little pouch for your purse if you want to go the more affordable route I would met recommend these cute little long champ pouches these are adorable this tab some people say can be a little cumbersome but I like it because I think it's adorable and it's reminiscent of the large bag this is in a beautiful pink but you open it up it has a nice little long champ zipper pull and you can fit so much in here so many lipsticks this is perfect for your purse if you want to put like lipsticks or a mirror or you want to put like a nail file um, hand sanitizer this is a good one if you want to be a little more luxe then I would recommend going for the little Prada pouch this is a more recent purchase of mine I got it in the pink but it does also come in a black as well I'm actually using it now and on the inside I have a little Chanel lip balm I have a perfume and then I have another mirror which by the way speaking of mirrors if you do not want the Chanel or the Dior mirror maybe consider this one this actually came in a kit it was a YSL fragrance kit and you got this little mirror and I use this in here as well for some reason I'll carry three mirrors at times you never know when you're gonna have something on your teeth but definitely consider a cute little pouch where that special someone can keep all of their things organized so this is the more affordable option and this is the more luxe option okay the next option I debated whether or not I should put it in this video but I definitely wanted to because it's something that goes in and out of stock so even though it's sold out now it is constantly going in and out of stock at different real retailers and it is the Chanel holiday kits these are hot commodities they are so hard to get I did a dedicated video and I also did a giveaway on those but if you're curious as to what's in the kits definitely check that out but these are great because not only do they come with useful items but they also come with the beautiful pouch so this one um, this one in particular is the absolute allure makeup set it comes with a lip color and a mascara and then it comes with this beautiful bag that you can use for travel a lot of people have also converted these into bags um, a heated mess or Cindy she did a video a couple years ago showing you how how to convert this to a handbag so that's really good but yeah these kits are hard to get but they're really really good I got almost all of them and I actually gifted this to my friend Pam one of the lips lip gloss one and she wasn't able to get it but it came back in stock and I got it for her and she was really excited so that's what I mean I was hesitant to mention these but they are constantly coming back in stock so I wanted to mention them and I will link them down below just in case they do all right the next gift item is a luxury fragrance and boy oh boy can perfumes be expensive nowadays it is crazy but I want to share with you three of my favorite luxury fragrances the first one is definitely a splurge it is Chanel Gardenia now this is really you can get it on the Chanel website or you can get it in the Chanel boutique but it is so lovely this is a very very special scent I am not someone that typically likes floral scents but I love this gardenia scent I have so many bottles of this because I'm just afraid of running out of it but it comes in a nice sleek bottle magnetic top I love this and I think I've mentioned to you any there was one time on the Chanel website where anytime you made a makeup purchase you had the ability to choose gardenia as your free sample so I would like place multiple orders just to get that well now if I ever place an order with my Chanel sales associate, I'll ask if she can throw those in so I can use them in my purse because I love that. So we have Chanel Gardenia. Another one that is my favorite is Tom Ford Lost Cherry. This one is like a warm cherry scent. I'm normally a fruity scent type of gal, but this is a cherry smell with a little bit of a warmness to it. Now these Tom Ford fragrances can be super expensive, so I would wait for a sale. A lot of times Bloomingdale's will have 15% off. You know, Nordstrom, it'll go on sale as well. So definitely wait for a sale for this. So that's my next one. And then the next one is Baccarat Rouge 540. I have talked about this till I'm blue in the face, but I wanted to share with you a couple things for Baccarat. I did recently do a Black Friday haul and I ended up picking, um, this is the body oil. And I also got the body lotion, I got the perfume, 
then there is a little set where you get three of these. And the nice thing about this is I actually got this from Neiman Marcus. If you spent 400, you got a hundred off. It included these fragrances. If you spent 250, I got 50 off. So I would recommend if you want Baccarat Rouge specifically, do not pay full price. It's always going on sale. And I always try to share it with you on the website. And the nice thing too, is if when I went into Neiman Marcus, uh, she actually um, put this in a nice little gift box for me and then she also had a little gift bag so you know go into the store or like online a lot of times there are free gifts with purchase but I love Baccarat Rouge 540 I can't get enough of it it was one of those scents where everyone was talking about it and when I went to a store and I sprayed it at first I was like I didn't really like it but then the dry down when I was walking around I just fell in love with it and now you hear me talk about it all the time you see me buying it all the time so you know you could consider getting just the fragrance or you could get like a little set and put it in a nice little gift box but yeah these are my three top picks for fragrances I love Gardenia, Lash Cherry and Baccarat Rouge 540 oh and one more thing when I went into Neiman the lady was kind enough to provide me with a little Mason Francis Curgeon little candle so you never know you never know what kind of free gifts with purchase they're gonna have but I am all about that free gifts all right another item I do not have in front of me because it is too large but I had to include it in this video because there have been a ton of sales and I love it it is my Kendra Scott jewelry box boy oh boy is that pricey but I use it to display some of my more luxurious jewelry pieces it's so beautiful it's white and then it has these acrylic handles and it's expensive it's $275 but Kendra Scott has been doing 30% off 40% off so I'm always sharing those deals on Instagram so make sure you're following me but that would be such a good gift just to keep your night your jewelry organized if you don't want to get the big one I did want to mention one that is a they do have one that's a little smaller and that one I use to keep all of my diamonds in from idol I think I've shared that before in my videos, but that's that's another good one if you didn't want to splurge on the large one. But I will tell you, the large one is like a piece of artwork. It is so beautiful, displayed. I have it in my little office area. That's where I keep my jewelry box, but you keep it in your closet. And it looks so nice. I just love it, and I would highly, highly recommend either one of those. All right, let's talk about an item that is so super pricey, but I had been wanting it for a long time and I waited until there was a sale and I'm really glad that I got it. I truly am. And it is the Dyson blow dryer. Now I will say I was torn between the Dyson blow dryer or the air wrap. I ended up going for the dryer because I thought, well, that's something I'm going to use every day. I don't know if I'm going to know how to use the air wrap. I use my curling wands to curl my hair but I have been using the Dyson every day and there's a technology where it's not pumping out that heat that is harmful for your hair. And I'll tell you, I feel like I've noticed a difference in my hair. It dries my hair extremely quick. And one of the attachments that I really like is if I want to wear my hair straight, there have, there's an attachment. It's like a curved attachment. And when I use it, it'll make sure I don't have any frizzies and it'll just kind of smooth my hair. Now I've only used two attachments. It does come with a couple others, but I really wanted this one because it had turquoise and pink. If you don't want that one, there is also a pretty blue and pink and I was torn on which one to get. But so far I have been loving the Dyson. A lot of you will ask me though, is it worth the price? I definitely want to do a review in the future. Now worth it, could you buy another blow dryer and blow dry your hair the same way? Sure, you definitely could. But a lot of people say that the Dyson is really good for your hair over time. So the jury's still out on whether or not it's worth it. But so far, I have been liking it and I think now would be a really good time to get that for a gift it's normally around 500 I got it for around four um, with the coupon but I have seen like Nordstrom has had it on sale and a couple other retailers have as well so if someone in that in your life has been wanting the Dyson definitely check it out now is a good time with all the sales okay the next item I want to mention is kind of like a little set and what I mean by that it with it being the end of the year 
I know these are a little hard to get, but if you can get your hands on them, I think it would be a great idea. And it is the little Louis Vuitton pocket agenda. Now, the reason I think this would be great is you can buy so many inserts on Etsy, and I have gotten you guys turned on to a bunch of these as well, and you can personalize it. So here is my little pocket agenda. This is what I use for daily appointments, you know, Sky's sports schedule, and I love it. And I got this little dashboard cover that is just adorable. I will link that down below. I've gotten so many of you turned on to it. If you don't like this one, she has a ton of others to choose from. But then I also have this cute little the cute little months where um, this Etsy seller in particular is just like so creative. But if you get this, you know, I just, I find myself, I love planning now because I can open my little planner and it's personalized and I just absolutely love it. And I also have the larger size. So this is the one I use for my purse, but I have the larger size, which is more expensive. So that's going to exceed the threshold. But I love this and I will link the dashboard covers and I'll try to find this on the pre-love market as well. But I think this could be a really, really nice gift. I want to say the pocket agenda is around $3.50 in store and then you can get a lot of the inserts for like $10, $20. Bucks. This one in particular I want to say was under $10 and then I want to say the calendar the whole month was maybe like $20 bucks or something like that but super, super cute. I want to talk jewelry for a second and I want to talk about a pair of earrings that have actually surprised me. Now I will say I tried to stick to around the 500 or under mark. This one is a little more than 500 but if there's someone in your life who loves fashion jewelry and they love Dior, I would recommend these Dior earrings. I purchased these how long ago? Months ago, but I've already worn them so much. They look really nice with like a cream sweater. I actually wore them the other day when I went out with my friend Pam. They look really nice when you dress up, but they have the ball that goes in the front and then there's this large ball that goes behind your earlobe. I will kind of show you. I'll put one in. I actually am not wearing earrings today, so but you put it in and it looks like that. Super, super cute, but I love how it has the antique, and I'll just wear these, I'll wear these the rest of the, uh, the video since I don't have earrings on. But I just love the way they look. Again, you can dress them up, you can dress them down, they're just super, super cute. Not only that, if you don't want the antique, they also come, I have them in the pink as well, which is really pretty. So I would definitely recommend these. Now, some people are not into paying a lot of money for fashion jewelry. I love fashion jewelry like Chanel and Dior, I absolutely love that. But if you want, you can always save your money, put it towards diamonds or something like that. It's whatever you prefer. But I love these earrings, and I've been using them so much this year, that's why I wanted to include them in today's video okay the next item I want to share is a recent purchase but I also have a, an item on my wish list as well so I love Burberry scarves I recently picked this up because I thought it would be good for the holiday this is cashmere it is so soft I think this in red would be great if you're not into the red I would recommend just the classic Burberry print but the one that I have on my wish list is a royal blue that one is so so, so pretty, but I'm waiting for a deal, whether or not I, I can get a gift card event or gift with purchase or something like that, I'm waiting. But I think this would be a great gift because it is a rather expensive scarf that someone might not necessarily buy for themselves. So if you were to get anyone a Burberry scarf, I think that they would love it. So again, I have the red one. I also have the regular one, which I'll put a picture of. And then there is a blue one that I just is on my wish list. So don't be surprised if by the end of the year you see me purchasing it because I wanted it for so long I'm just waiting for that deal I, I'm all about luxury goods but I like to have that deal I like to feel like I'm getting something with my money and a lot of times they will do like gift card events so I'm waiting for that but I think this would be an amazing gift idea okay, I have three more items to share the next item I want to share are some candles so candles are one of those things like my mom for example she burns candles all the time but she likes Yankee or Bath and Body Works but she would never splurge on a nice luxury candle so I think this would be a great luxe gift for that special someone in your life who loves candles I'd recommend a couple I'd recommend Diptyque this is Bayes this one not only does it smell nice but it looks good on display so once you're done with burning it you can use this to store like makeup brushes or something. If you don't want this one, I'd recommend Baccarat Rouge 540. 
it smells so good just like bad wrap but it also looks good with holiday decor i have it in my closet next to my red chanel bag but i love both of these dior also has so many good candles i actually have a lot of those downstairs in my living room but they also have like candle kits and they have a new one for the holidays which i think are like gold so i'll link those down below as well but i definitely think a good luxury candle would be another gift because someone might not necessarily splurge on this and if they don't want to burn it you can use it for display a lot of times i'll use these for display but you can still smell the scent it is just so lovely i want to mention sunglasses a nice luxury pair of sunglasses and the ones that i want to mention like i would have recommended the fendi sunglasses because i wear those all the time but those are so hard to get they go in and out of stock and i want to get share with you a more recent purchase that i got but i thought these would be a good gift because they recently went on sale and they are these prada sunglasses i picked these up in my black friday haul i knew i had been wanting these for years but I was just waiting for them to go on sale and I was just kind of trying to figure out which one I wanted because they had some similar to this that had the Prada Triangle, but I ended up going with these. I liked how they kind of tilted in, the kind of like the butterfly effect. But the thing about these, not only are they nice and sturdy, but they're really lightweight as well. And mine, and I don't know if this will vary where you get them. I got mine from Bloomingdale's and it came with this like really, really cute little hard case, which I really, really like. See, it says like Prada right there. So these are so, so cute. I'd recommend a nice luxury pair of sunglasses, but again, wait for them to go on sale. These were normally $4.33 and I got them for $3.03 plus I had $50 rewards to Bloomingdale. So I got a really good deal. So again, if you want to buy them, wait for a sale. I always share the sales on my Instagram, so stay tuned. But this is another really, really great gift idea. Okay, guys, we are down to my final gift idea and it is in this box so it is a little unboxing i have not opened this yet but i thought it would be fun to unbox it together and this is another item that might not be for everybody but i think it would be a nice gift idea because of the price because someone might not want to buy it for themselves and as you can tell by ysl comes in a little dust bag the item i picked up is this beautiful beautiful YSL brooch. I have been wanting this for years. A brooch is not something that's for everybody. I got into brooches a few years ago when I purchased my Chanel brooch. And because I love this one so much, I knew I wanted the YSL one, but I was waiting for the right one. Now this one has some texture to it. There's also one I saw in store that's a little smaller, but these look nice when you're wearing a blazer and you put it like, you know, on the lapel. I actually wore this when I went to the Matt Reif comedy show I had a blazer on and jeans but I wanted to just add something so I didn't wear any earrings but it just added something or I'll wear these a lot like I think I wore this with my pink jacket where I might not have had a lot of jewelry on but it just kind of like elevates the look and I wanted this one because YSL is one of my favorite handbag brands and a lot of my YSL bags um, have the gold, and I thought this would look nice on um, a jacket, on a blazer. Like I said, it just elevates it. So these are a little pricey, but they are under the $500 mark, but someone might not buy it for themselves. The Chanel brooch, I love. I wear it all the time, but I definitely wanted the YSL to add to my collection. I only have two brooches, but now I think my collection is pretty much complete since I have both. So I think this would be an amazing gift idea not only could you wear it on a blazer you could wear it on a jacket you could even if you wanted to like even just wear it on a shirt as well like I said it just elevates your style it really dresses it up and I think this would be a great gift idea okay my friends there you have it share with you actually about 14 gifts so hopefully this helps you again these are all Lux gifts and if you were to get anyone any of these gifts I know they would absolutely love it because again a lot of these are things that someone might not necessarily buy for themselves because of the price so if you gifted this to anybody I'm sure they would love it like usual I will link every everything down below. If you guys are new to my channel, I would love to have you hit that little subscribe button and I would love to have you follow me on Instagram as well. Thank you guys so much for watching. Have a wonderful day and I'll see you in my next video.
Hang out on the beach with our friends.